Welcome to the Pregistry Channel. My name is Allison, and today I'm going to talk about pH levels during pregnancy. If you've heard about the alkaline diet fad, you may have wondered if it is worth a try. After all, if you are suffering from heartburn, especially during pregnancy, you're probably willing to try anything for some relief. But here's the scoop on the alkaline diet. It will not change your body's pH. The pH scale has an alkaline side and an acid side. The alkaline diet promises to move your body from being more acid to less acid, which would then reduce acid reflux or heartburn. Drinking expensive alkaline water and avoiding acidic foods will not change the pH of your blood because, as it turns out, blood pH levels don't really change much. The body's natural blood pH is 7.4. Your pH will change a little from time to time, but the changes are small. For example, you might have a little more acid in your blood after a really hard workout. On the other hand, your blood pH might move the other way toward the alkaline side if you go up to a high altitude too quickly. In these situations, a change in pH is natural, but your body will work to bring your pH back to 7.4. You and your fetus are very sensitive to shifts in blood pH, but don't worry. Your body will naturally take care of keeping your pH levels healthy. So what about your pregnancy symptoms? Heartburn, nausea, vomiting? All definitely a bummer, but not caused by extra acid to your blood. For example, heartburn during pregnancy is caused by your growing uterus pushing against your stomach. Turning to a fad diet for a quick fix might be tempting, but you could end up missing out on certain nutrients. Discuss your diet with your doctor to make sure you're getting all of the important nutrients you need for you and your baby. Thanks for watching. Find out more about diet and nutrition during pregnancy at pregistry.com.